Good afternoon to you here on Youth Empowerment Television Show, your most authoritative youth analysis program you can find across the African continent. Six minutes after one, and we are live here. Now, this is your most authoritative youth analysis program you can find across the African continent, like I said. Ah, so if you're watching us across the over 40 African countries that we are live, if you want to join the conversation, all you need to do is to send your message to us by adding the Ghana country code 00233 or plus 233, then you add 548-50379. Those watching us on Facebook, don't forget to click the like button, share, and also comment beneath the comment section so we read it for you as the show goes on. We are also live on Multi TV, Digital TV, Satellite TV, Go TV. I mean, all your TV, your your, your TV platforms. We are live inside the studios. Today, my guest is seated. We are doing a personality profile. We bring to you personality profile sections where we bring very, very high standard achieving young people who are doing so well. People whose life has great source of motivation and have had a lot of impact upon our industry and also amongst the lives of many young people benjamin gazi mensa is my guest uh, i'm sure <laughs> you're, you're wondering how we got to know that full name but people of the whole country and even beyond we know him to be mix master gazi and he's our guest here chairman you're welcome such a pleasure such Sorry. a pleasure to have you wow but the, the first question now I, I want to ask and guys because it's a youthful program we'll be blending english and pg and stuff so you guys have a feel of the show so uh, was it always known to you that you were going to be big? I mean, from childhood, you know, some people can say, Oh, no, nah, nah, no, see, I go make them, but oh, yeah, 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 mm. yeah, for sure, for sure. Mm, mm, I know, mm. say, I go, I go make them because wow. you know, coming from way back, we started doing this music, then as you know, as something that we love, mm -hmm. you understand. Mm -hmm. So, you know, when we were young, we started using small, small things, you know, playing small drums. Then, when we, we get to a certain stage, we went yeah. to the church playing, yeah. you know, instruments keyboard and instruments that. and all that. Mm. Yeah, so we knew that we really want to, you know, follow this music thing. Yeah, yeah. Wow, wow. D did it take too long? You see, people say, okay, me, I hustled before I got here and all of that. Did it Did it become smooth or you really ought to have to go through the hustle? For the hustle, yeah, everybody needs to go through. Mm -hmm. And I don't know if they do. We have type of hustle. Yeah. Some owners like this, others are like this. Yeah. It might happen that I have a whole lot of money or my parents have money or all that, mm -hmm. but I still have to hustle to make something happen. Yeah. Yeah, because even when you sit down, you want to learn. It means you're hustling because you want to get that good grade. Mm -hmm. So you have to crack your mind. Mm -hmm. It's part of hustling because if you don't hustle on that, you can't make it. You understand? So, mm -hmm. you know, we all pass through hustling and it, it has been something that has helped us to, you know, be where we are now. Wow. Wow. Um, d d apart, apart from being... Um a, a great sound engineer known for all the greatness you've achieved and all of that D did you have any other dream you wanted to that you don't want to do something else before you had no option that to go to 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 this did you have something you wanted to do as well no i, I really wanted to do music even though i was studying other course you know mm -hmm. that's how it has been when you're the okay. school that we go now it's like when you start school, it's RME, social studies, math, yeah. science. So, <laughs> even the music and dance, granted, it's not like the way you yeah. have to do music. That one, yeah. you go some small break time, yeah, then you go play music, then you go see, yeah. they go teach you put some dance. Yeah. That'd be the music and dance we do yeah. for school. Mm. So, it, it, it's not really technical, yes. Yeah. So, um, getting to certain stage, I know, said no, even when I, fitch, I finished the junior high school, uh -huh. I wanted to go to the um, senior high school, maybe around Riniba, because I know there's uh -huh. one music school in Riniba, uh -huh. you know. so but I wasn't able to get a chance. So everything about me has been like music, music. Even when I was in school, Charlie, we go run away small, go do one or two things for some ghetto, mm. some studio get to be some things. You I, understand? I, I sure say the time you start self, there, there was no uh, more or less like social media, digital media to yeah, learn was online. Was not, was not. Was not How did you become? You even have your personal computer. You have to visit the cafe, oh. you know, to go and learn one, one or two things there to download some of the software and all that. When you get a certain state now, you're saying, okay, now you have, you have, you are in a state, you can buy you a laptop or a computer okay. to also use at home yeah. and all that because those things were not common and also it was used for certain things. So mm -hmm. it's not like now that, you know, we, the young ones, yeah. we have phones, yeah. iPhones, laptops, iPads yeah, yeah, yeah. that they even just used to play game. Yeah. Then you can't even get those things to play game. If you want to do it, unless you go to one friend's house yeah. or one cafe or anything to, to do that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, uh, <laughs> would you say um, 
the young people as they find themselves who are watching us now are more privileged than the time you were coming up you know as 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 as, as a real youth you see you, you know what i can say is in in every situation or in every year or every uh maybe generation generation yeah there's something new okay. and there's that new thing still they also need to still grind on it before wow maybe you know way back when um our legends like the tiny Coco Valley Dev and all those things. Their time of music was different, uh -huh. and they were making it. They were yeah. big. Yeah. And that time, the money they were having is like wow, big money. Yeah. But now, it's like it's not big money. Yeah. So now the new generation are also looking for the bigger money. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So that's there will be another generation who will see ours now is old, and then now the new is a crowd. So <laughs> ours is now. So mm. it is it is the generation and what comes in at that time. So. Everyone has his own struggle and his, his own wins. But people, people, I mean, for, for the lot of people that are working there, is there a difference between a, a record producer and a sound engineer? Is there a difference? Yeah, there's a difference. So, mm. um, basically, a record producer or a music producer um, does most of the things, has more knowledge about, you know, arranging of song, writing of song, okay. making the beats, composing, okay. adding of rhythms, you know, mixing and mastering. Whilst the sound engineer mostly deals with sound, making sure we have the right output, making sure the sound sounds good. Okay. So in re in record producer or music producer, you have all these things combined. Others are like just beat makers. They make beats. Oh, okay. And then that's all. Okay, so they are beat makers who are not, uh, they don't master and mix. Yes. I see. Yeah, so they make beats and then they send it to mixing and mastering engineer. Then he too will do that. So we, we had a chance to learn all side. So I can make beats, I can make some master, I can record, I can help you write your song, I can direct your song, I can arrange your song. So me, I'm a full package, so I can call myself as a record producer. Yeah. yeah. So there are people who only play an all round record producer. Yes. Yeah. So every part of the music side, mm. we really, you know, learned and then we, we know what to do when mm. it comes to. Mm. So there are other people that it is. They only do the other side. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. that is it. So there's a whole lot of differences. Music has its own sub, you know, yeah, arrangement yeah, and all that yeah. that we need to study. So it's not just about waking up, recording a song, and boom. No. Everywhere. You have the talent, but you need to study something small wow. to help you grow. Wow. So if you're a young person and you're watching us, I'm sure you guys are getting the the, the details you need from 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 him such, such i mean i mean he's 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 solid so 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 far as this, this, this space he occupies and this industry is concerned uh, uh he's a he's a very celebrated um, um <clears throat> a record producer and we have to have him here to inspire most of the young people watching you are excellent brilliant in afro beat afro pop high life dancehall hip-hop r&b you don't like gospel yeah gospel too Okay. Have, have you worked on any gospel? Yeah, I've worked a couple of gospel artists. Oh, I see. Wow. You know, from way back. Mm. And some of our, you know, um, hip -hop artists, artists yeah. they will still do gospel. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, I've worked yeah. with a couple of gospel artists. And wow. I have a new one that is coming soon, but mm. I will not mention now. Wow. One of this popular gospel musician. I think she's a female. Yeah. Though, so we will bring in some, mm. some bangers very soon. <laughs> <laughs> we 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 can that's, really saying, that. that is where we started from yeah. you know from the church so when it comes oh, to gospel okay. that is our field yeah like, that is something that we can even sleep and be playing wow yeah. wow wow but what's your favorite instrument i mean being in church and all of that is it the drums is it the piano is it what trumpet yeah mostly um I started the technical with, side the engineer so way back i started with drums more yeah and i uh, i started with the piano and a little of bass guitar yeah but right now i do more of the piano okay Wow, 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 wow. I, I want to find out this from you. I mean, if, if everybody checks you, there's one interesting thing you do that people don't really take their mind on. Dick's joking. Mm -hmm. I, I'm sure very minute people know that you, 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 you do DJing too. I mean, you, you, don't, you don't take that serious enough? Yeah, I do. I take it serious. But, you know, at times we're just trying to concentrate to get a certain direction well. Exactly. So that's why I say, um, mm. you know, I had this... I had a small course about this joking on, on the, when I attended the um, GIG. Uh, so I did a whole lot of course. Because when, when I was coming, I remember I told you that there was not that music something. Yeah, that's true. So when we heard that, oh, this, they do music, they, do, they learn about this thing, 
entertainment, broadcasting, and all those kind of things. We feel like, okay, let's go and... You need to upgrade from that. Let's side, go yeah. there and learn one or two things. Mm -hmm. Even though what we wanted to do was not really what they were doing, yeah. like the production and yeah. all that, but we had a little mm. bit of knowledge and all that. Yeah. You know, learn how to present, how to host show, and then, you know, how to DJ small, how mm. to do one or two things. Mm. So, um, I think when also... I think most of the times I've played for artists when we go for like big shows, like yeah. way back from Tema, like Stage A, Deep Crime, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Stoneboy, Puerto Ranking, all those. Like, you know, when yeah. we travel around, yeah. I, I play for them, I do it for like on tours yeah. and all wow. that. Wow, 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 wow. Your, your experience with uh, uh, XFM as, as a DJ, did that also inspire? In, inspire yeah, so you, know, like, you know, most of the times when you finish school or you complete, they will ask you to do some small services. Yeah, yeah, attachment those and those things. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I had a chance to go there and do one of the things for a certain month. Mm. And then, you know, it's all plus. Mm, mm, mm. In, in, in 2015, how did you feel when you were, you were nominated in the Vodafone Ghana Music Award? I mean, producer of the year category. Did you feel like, yo, I've arrived? <laughs> uh, actually, you know, I've been that one person that coming, growing as a young um, person, uh, mm. I've always been there. Like, you know, anywhere I go, I, I try to stand out as some somebody or mm -hmm. I try to have a, that kind of, you know, recognition there. Mm -hmm. But, you know, we coming to this extent and, you know, getting to some certain platform was a privilege mm -hmm. because... It shows me that, okay, well, you are really working yeah. and you don't need to give up, you need to put in work. Mm -hmm. So it was a nice platform for me and since then, you know, it has been back to back, back and to all back of that to back and, to back. and stuff. Hmm. Um, we would come to your recent project, which was Talk of Town. I mean, really? amazing facility. But yeah, I mean, yeah. It, was, it was almost... It was, it was almost on all the all, all the all the all the new sites. I'm sure you've you've seen it yourself. No, but no, I've not seen it. <laughs> really? it is. Wow. It is. Charlie, we see the cubicles, the office, the entire thing. Hey, Charlie, smart. We, we, we come and look at how much your 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 your, your net worth because we hear say it's of millions of of Ghana City. Wow. But um, I mean, you 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 spoke about um, working with certain artists. You mentioned uh, even on tour, you know, at the backstage uh, DJing and all of those stuff. What to you has been your biggest record? Like you were like this song, put me out there. It's about to happen very soon. Hey, the Emu Kray Emu. Okay, very well. So all those who are watching us here uh, on Pan African TV, keep your messages coming on zero five four eight five zero three seven nine nine zero five four eight five zero three seven nine nine. And forty minutes into the show, we are going to open the phone line so you can ask uh, him all the questions that you would want to. Uh, ask him so far as this conversation is concerned those who are also uh, sending your messages on facebook will be reading it for you as the show and the conversation is going on uh, 0548 if you're watching us out of ghana within the over 40 african countries don't forget to add the country code 00233 or plus 233 then you add 548503799 so that we can be able to uh, read it for you now I have some messages here on whatsapp and i'd like to read this one says that how did you end up working with pato rankin oh uh, well best mm. what best point the vocal yeah so uh you know good work sells itself mm. and then i think we, we met some time mm -hmm. but then it was like hey what best hey pato like you know and i think some years back he came to ghana he won best african artist yeah in the VGA, international art yeah international art yeah mm. and then I think he performed with Stoneboy. We did the pull-up remix. Okay. That was around 2014 or so. Mm. So it was it was by. Wow. So we met two at the awards mm. time after they finished performing. So I said, oh, Charlie, that was a mad performance. Wow. Congratulations too for your win. And then I think you killed my beat as well. So we will do more. Do more, more, yeah. Yeah. So since then, months later, a year later, we linked up. We travel. Mm. We, went, we went to work. You know, and all that. And wow. That's how the whole thing started. Wow. You know, Personal relationship vibe also was great. It's true. You feel like oh, this guy is somebody mm. that you know is cool. I can work with and work with more. Wow, you know? wow, wow. This one, th th let me read that. Uh, this one to Noni. It says that did working with Patoranki open the Nigerian music industry for you? Would you say that? Yeah, but you know, before I met Patoranki, I've already worked with Davido too. I visited Davido. I went to Davido's house yeah, for like yeah, almost yeah. two or three months. 
Wow. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So we, we've been cool like that. And then I know a few of a couple of Nigerian artists. But one thing about me is me, I don't really try to put things out there. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, there are places that we don't run your mouth. Yeah. That, you know, I can say that maybe some of the Ghanaian producers or artists have not been there. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't come and pose. I'm the first producer. Yeah, like yeah, all those yeah. things. You don't we blow your own trumpets. Yeah. Pose it out. So, yeah. So, because I remember the first time, the time we were recording Activate by Stonewall and Davido. Yeah. So I came late. So Stone and Davido were already working on something. So, so I said, ah, Charlie, David say come. We, make we do something. Like, you know, he said come, but it's my idea, some vibe. So come up, we see. Because I've been that one person that, you know, everybody sees me moving. Yeah. I have, like, my mobile studio or anything. So something yeah. like that, I was the only person that he called. Yeah. He said, okay, let me come. So we went to the apartment. So David, yeah, so this is one of my producers. David said, ah, you they come into this guys give me. Now, me and Ajahn, we used to Ajahn 14, 15, they're my house. Now, now me for intro, this guys, I said, okay, then Charlie, make we do it. I just yeah. make it. Boom. So we've, we've been like that, you know. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Uh, I'm sure I'm sure all the young people who, who wants to be like Miss Master Gazi, you are getting the inspiration that you have to you have to get. Okay, this one too, uh, from Emilia. It says that would you say Stoneboy is a Ghanaian artist you have worked many times with as compared to other artists? Mm, yeah, I can say that because we all had a bigger hit together when mm -hmm. we released Pulu. It's yeah. one of our biggest hits yeah. that it put us all on uh, that another platform like mm. you know we're all doing our best we're all doing you know coming up good stoma was good from samini's camp was doing his own thing and all that after that and we had our heads and it, it, like you know it took us to another platform yeah. so we've worked and since then we've been working 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 and then uh, i've worked on a couple of his albums you know yeah i think we have more work so and him um, Adam, Captain Planet, mm -hmm. Easy, Becca. Like, most of the times when I work with one artist, we try to do more okay. before, you know, any other thing. So, yeah. any artist that I work with, we do more. Yeah. Have more songs to it beside, yeah. like, you know. And it's also coming out with the album, so we have a couple of songs already recorded. Like, wow. So, that's, that's how we do it. Wow. Wow. Okay. So, this one, uh, uh, is it Alf Alfreda? And Alfreda wants me to 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 ask you. Uh, this is a bit personal, but uh, let me. Oh yeah, make the answer. You sure? Yeah, yeah, we'll give him uh, an answer. Ah, uh, okay. So let me go to Alfreda. Mm. Alfreda, he says that ask him if he is settled. I mean, being in the entertainment industry and settlement. I mean, marriage, relationship. Is there something he wants to comment? Nehon nehon you see, in as much that you know, mm. our our system or our um, society or how, our religion tells us how it has to work. Mm -hmm. You know, the rules or regulations about you know trying to settle that it has to be done in a certain way. Yeah. But apart from being that, that is just doing it for everybody to see that officially. Yeah, of course. Yeah. But we, are, I can say, I'm even doing it like I'm already there. Yeah. Yeah, I'm already settled. It's just for me to just bring in as okay officially. That, yeah, that's yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> this one says that, hello, please ask our current best record producer whether he has... Okay. Please, hello, please ask our current best record producer whether he ever worked with uh, Macasio from the north. I would like to see a great work between him and Macasio. Yeah, we've okay. met a couple of times. We've talked like, tell her, oh, we've come. Yeah. yeah, we'll go meet to tell her. Yeah, tell her. That'll be how it has been. Yeah, 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 yeah. So the day we will meet, it'll be fireworks. Uh, <laughs> <no. laughs> <laughs> right, right. Okay, this one also says that, how did you arrive into artist management? I mean, we all know what, what you're doing with, 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 with Lyrical Joe, yeah. who, who wanted us to, to enter there. But how did you end up with artist management? Yeah, because um, we, we always work with artists. We have see how the things are going. We have see direction. And you see, we've supported artists that looks like we were managing them way back. Okay. But our own was just supporting. Because mm -hmm. they have having artists that will come to the studio, have to give the artists money, you know, buy food, record free. When the song is about to release. Record free. When about the song is about to release, I will distribute it for the artists. I'll put it where I'll give it to the bloggers, everything, and, you know. And that is a work of a like a manager, manager or yeah. something. But we took it like oh, like we are family, and that's all. So we've been doing that. So we got a certain point. We feel like oh, no. After that, 
then somebody will hold them and they will become bigger after somebody will hold them and that is all and mm -hmm. all, no percentage all, or, yeah. they blow and we don't get anything again or not. so right now we need to put them on paper you understand okay yeah so it I has been it. like that mm. but, but but why did you decide with, with lyrical joe yeah, so Lubuka Joe is a very talented person. We've yeah. met a couple of times as like a Makasio team. Yeah. Oh, brother, we could do something. Oh, what's my child? For come Tema, we could do something. At that time, you know, we in Tema. Oh, I forgot. Oh, yeah, if we get them, we'll do. Don't worry. We'll scare the time. Like, so, it has been like that. So, there was one friend of mine who he also knows, like, he's his friend. So, he has been telling the person, oh, tell him, big man, me, they try you. Support me so much more and mm -hmm. all that. Mm -hmm. So, the guy just said, oh, yeah, it's, it's, you are good. We, I'll see what to do. But myself, this music to me, I'm not really into it. Yeah. But I have a friend. Let me call him and see. And yeah. who is the friend? That is me. Uh, so he comes, oh, but look at you. They are good. We did they, they, they try in there. So if you are ready to support and all that, they are, we will do it. Me, I'm already ready to support. But at times, to get to some certain stage, I also need support from other people. Course, and yeah. other. So if we team up, we can do it. So, you know, mm -hmm. we team up and then. Today, Luka Joe is here winning our wow. best rapper, the whole of Ghana. Did you see that coming? Before that, self, I know it is a beast already. So yeah, 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 yeah. It is not even something that yeah. all what we need is, you know, our industry is like that. Mm -hmm. Most of the times when something happens, they try to make it look like a competition. Yeah. So the only thing is they will try to wait and see what you can do. They are trying to wait whether you have to fail or you have to, like, you see, the, the tennis has always been like more of negative yeah uh, pushing a negative vibe more but yeah. trust me we are going to check that now wow 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 okay let me let me let, let me let me read this one this one says that i am william from accra uh, <laughs> can you please take uh, uh can you please take out your eyes your eyeglass or go go see how you spell the go go they want to see your beautiful eyes yeah. Okay. Now I'm sure you you've seen the beautiful the beautiful yeah, eyes. The most wanted, the baddest. <laughs> All right, he's not done for you. Okay. Uh, this one says that um what, what uh, yeah, that's not really clear. This person was asking me what happened between him and Eno. I mean, lyrical Joe and Eno. Did anything happen? Oh, I'm not sure. Maybe you want to say Eno because you know I signed Eno to on my label, right? Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah because then the person asked the first question about access management, lyrical Joe, and he's asking what happened between he, him, and Eno on the management. I'm sure. Yeah. Oh yeah, sometimes. Yeah, so you know, we also started way back with Eno mm -hmm. from 2013. They're supporting, supporting. As I said, we were supporting them like just like that. So we got a certain that's okay. Like let's do it official. We announced it. We did a, a launch and a signing at the mall. People came. We posted everything. We shot videos. We released things. We get to a certain stage. She need, she now need to go and do her own thing on her own self and all that. So yeah, we we started doing something. Yeah. You know, we put her into some certain space, and then she has to continue. So the same thing applies to Lewis Kajo. When we go, when we get to a certain stage, you now we feel like okay, you are okay now. You can do your thing. You go another person come. Okay, that's go, that, that's, like, that's how it she, looks as if you you, you yeah. have a real feel for rap when it has to do with artist management. <laughs> I don't know, <laughs> but then that's what happens, you know. Uh, wow. Wow, wow. It's not wow. even intentional, like, oh, mm. but you know, you don't really plan it. Yeah, yeah. It just come. Mm. You, you're, you're saying, you, you know, Lyrical Joe can really sing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah he's a good singer. I know, I know, I know, I know. LJ. <laughs> okay. Now, uh, uh, this one doesn't say, this one just says, hardworking man. And we say, okay, thank you so much. I think uh, he wants to, okay. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Let me come to text message. This one also says that what is the name of the, the label? I think it's the same. Uh, uh, two, uh, two, two MG. Music. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Two MG music. Two MG. So, what, 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 what does it stand for? Two MG music. Mm. Two MG music. Okay. Two M. Two M. Miss, okay, 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 okay. Right, right, right. <laughs> Miss Master Gazi. Straight. Uh, Miss Master. Music. Okay, this one says that. Okay, what is his baddest movement in the music industry? Me, my baddest movement. Yeah, baddest. <laughs> ah, the, the baddest, baddest movement. movement. See, I don't know, but I have a couple of them. Mm. And then the baddest one is yet to come. Okay, the baddest is yet to come. Mm. <laughs> this is this is quite interesting. This one says that. Um, I know he's one of the very few hit-making record 
producers in Ghana. I know he's making a lot of money and he, he charges exorbitantly. Hey, ask him if this is if this is true or false. And he gives me some figures: three hundred and fifty euro per hour, three hundred and fifty euro slash hour. Is that what you charge? Because I will get Ghana. I don't know whether he came. She, he, the person had to work with you when he or she came to Ghana. Uh, but him are you expensive to work with? Uh, it's, you take it's, time it's just to like, like yeah. what you want and you know if I can do it, we just do it. Mm, 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 it has to mm, depend mm, on what mm, you want mm, and you know. Mm, mm. Not this thing, guys, you can do it. That's all. Right, right. And, 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 from, and from that, it, it looks as if you don't really uh, uh, want to, you, 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 you don't run a, a charity organization anymore. It's, it's purely business. You don't go like, this person has talent, so and let me do something for, 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 for the person. No, not really. Mm. Mm. Right, so we're going to be opening the phone lines very soon. So all those who are watching, who wants to speak to uh, Miss Master, yeah, Darcy, make you call, make you this call. Be the, this be the time to make speak. Call, this call. be the time to speak with him. So we're going to put the phone lines on the screens right now, so that you guys can join the conversation. Uh, so please uh, get ready to make sure that you call. Let me quickly go to. Um, wow, let me come to the text message. Okay, the, okay. Uh, this one also says that what his, what is his biggest share he has received in a in a hit that blew the whole country. Biggest share. Mm. It's, That's uh, why I look at the person they talk about money matter. Like yeah. How much? <laughs> in a calculator. Yeah, they try calculator. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, like you know, let's say five years ago, we cry, and we had you know some ten thousand pounds be more. I know. Make my camera man the offer down, sir. Wow, that was like six years ago. Of course, ten k pound will be joking you by this time. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Would you say you you you've got oh, everything you get? I mean, you 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 have uh, also. Okay, we have a first caller. I'm sure they <laughs> Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, boss. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, boss. Hello, good afternoon. Guys. Yeah, if we can check the speakers balls. in the studio for me, I'll be very grateful. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, I can hear you, boss. I want to speak to Gazi. You want to speak to Gazi, yeah? Yes, please, yes, please. I want uh, to know, I want to know okay. his own name. And, uh, <laughs> And we're, 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 hello? Okay. Uh, right. We're, we're we're doing our best to make sure that we can let him speak. He says that he doesn't want to talk to me. He wants to talk to Gazi. Hey. So I beg you, please fix 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 the inner speaker for me so yeah. he speaks to Gazi. Yeah. <laughs> so uh okay. So make sure you call us on zero three zero. You can find a number beneath the the screens at the moment. So call us. Let's have this conversation. Okay. Minta Robert Yao. He says that 2MG Music is raising good talent. Kudos. And he sends this one from Facebook. So all those who are watching us on Facebook to bring your comments and we'll, we'll read it for you. Now, 030-2791-326. 030-2791-326. When you call, speak to your boss. I know, I know today <laughs> you want to have a conversation with him. So immediately you call. Then you have that conversation with 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 with, with him so i know right <laughs> whilst we're waiting let us read some few messages that are also here this one says that oh please i have talent too can he help me i beg him <laughs> he didn't bring your name he didn't bring your your name okay 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 right we have a caller hello good afternoon yeah afternoon hello good afternoon yeah good afternoon hello Yes, my name is Obed. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, my name is Obed. I can hear you. Hello, good afternoon. Right, we're, we're, we're going for a short break. When we come back, well, you guys can call so that you can have a direct uh, um, 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 conversation with Mix Master Gazi here. We'll be back just after this montage break. Stay tuned, we'll be right back. Oh. 
always be by your side, celebrating with you in moments of joy and happiness. Enjoy your everyday life with the slides of Cheesy Pizza. Cheesy Pizza, your pizza, your way. Welcome to Come Trading and Farms Limited. We are the sole importers and distributors of FM World Rulong Plus Plus Combined Harvesters. We are the sole importers and distributors of FM World Combined Machines. If you buy from us, spare parts are readily available. Our machines can pick and harvest logged rice as well as standing rice and its 102 horsepower. FM World tractors also have 110 horsepower, which is fully hydraulic and can break hard grounds. Our rotavators is also 102 horsepower. It works perfectly in muddy areas and in lands where tractors cannot operate. World Combined Harvesters come with automatic gear drive, diesel power engine, 1.77 cubic grain storage tanks, 2.2 meter cutting width, 360 degree unloading pipe and sunshade as well as two diesel filters. Our branches include Tamale Airport area, Accra Ritz Junction. Kindly call us on 0278-223-811 or 0550-108-899. As well as 020-1600-727. Don't buy fake. Buy original. Buy from us now. Come Trading and Farms Limited, your best importers and suppliers of FM World Rulong Plus Plus Combined Harvesters. to 9 o'clock p.m. every day. You should be watching The Couch. I'll tell you why. On Tuesdays, we talk social issues, lifestyle, health, all those everyday issues that affect us in the big way. Late Wednesdays are for book reviews. Thursdays are for the hard talk, those social, economic, policy-oriented, political questions that demand for the tough questions to be asked. And personality profiling Fridays, when we get to know the stories behind the winning personalities we love. Inspirational story from inspirational personalities. Hey, listen, you really cannot miss the couch with me, Amma, but still, the only TV show with a hat. Welcome back from the break, and uh, like like I said, we are going to be allowing you guys to speak to uh, Mix Max Dagazi here, so that you can have a conversation with 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 him. So call us on zero three zero two seven nine one three two six zero three zero two seven nine one three two six. Speak to him directly. I'm sure you guys have been inspired. I like I like one thing he said. He says that even at childhood. He decided to gather some instrument. There was passion. There was zeal. He had the direction right. Hustle is part of the process. There's no... In fact, it's just... You have to be part of the hustle. And so, it's a process for all of us to, to go through as young people. So, make sure you call and you have a conversation with him. So that, okay. Wow, we have a caller. Hello, good afternoon. Hello. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Hey. Your name and where you're calling from? Hello? Your name. Your, your name and where you're calling from. If we can increase the volume small for us. Hello, your name and where you're calling from, madam? This I'm from uh, Okay, let's hear you. Where are you calling from? I'm calling from Tichiman. Okay, let's hear you all the way from Tichiman. Um, please, don't speak with Mr. Magazi. Okay, he's here. He's listening. I'm here. Talk to me. 
Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm doing good. How are you? I'm fine. What's popping in Techima? Ah, we are managing on. Wow. Yeah. Um, please. I am. Um, let me say, I'm an actress, and I want you to help me. You are what? I'm a singer, like I sing. Oh, you are a singer. Yeah. Wow. Nice. Nice. So, what? What do you do? Afrobeat, dance or gospel, R and B? Yeah. Afrobeat. Afrobeat. Yes. Wow. Then you have to fight time one of the days. Then you pass through the two MG studio so that we can hear you. Okay. 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 Nice talking to you. Okay, thank you. Okay, Good bye. Night. Wow. So, so I'm sure, I'm sure this is one of the biggest news to you. He's giving you the opportunity to pass through the studio, yeah. and also have to hear yourself. And that, that's that, that that's uh, all right, all right. Zero three zero. Zero three zero two seven nine one three two six zero three zero two seven nine one three two six. Call and speak to him personally. Uh, whilst we are waiting for the calls, this one says that good afternoon, Pan African TV. Uh, good afternoon, Pan African TV to uh, to the world. Please, can you sign any artist despite the local language influence? Okay, we have another caller. Hello. Hello. Yeah, hello. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Your name and where you are calling from? Imano. Right, Imano, where are you calling us from? Tema. Right, TM for life. Let's hear you, Imano. I want to talk to Miss Matagazi. He's hey, here, he's hey, here. Hey, hey, what's up? TM for life. Yeah, TMG for life. Mad. What's up? What happened? Uh, Which community do you rep? Uh, the rep come to 10. Hey, come to 10 in the building, right? Charlie, now see the echo. Me too, I'll be Afro beat, I'll be Afro beat, Afro dancer. Oh, mad. So you know my studio for come to one? I found the opportunity to just maybe pass by and then... You see oh, Charlie, pass by a cry, you don't have food. Ah, tell my boy. Yeah. Pass by a cry, they make me feel <laughs> small. Yeah, but I don't know where the studio is. The studio there is Legon. Ah, okay, okay. Yeah, so if you check 2MG Music on... Google or anywhere on the map and anything will just bring you to 2MG Music Studios. All right, all right. 2MG for life. Bless up, man, G. Right, right, right. So, so call us on 03027. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, by the time we finish there, your studio, if you be live, go there. <laughs> 03027913260. Yeah. 03027913260. This one says that when is he having his own music tour in europe or america we outside also like his vibe and we want to have a connection with him are there, are there plans advanced for for that yeah i've been i've been doing that i've been traveling i've been touring mm. around you know production mm. sections in other countries so yeah. definitely when when i'm set to do a new one i will yeah. put it out for people to you know yeah. but still we can still link up and mm. do you know transfer files and all that and still yeah. start working but right well. now everything is on be the global yeah. village so yeah you go feed well Sharp, sharp, sharp. Okay, we have another caller. Hello, good afternoon. Yeah, good afternoon. Yes, boss. Your name and where you're calling us from? Yeah, man. My name is Pan. All right, Pan. Talk, talk to Gazi. Gazi is here. Pan. Yo, Gazi. What's up, Miji? I'm a... Gazi. Yeah, they here. What's up? What happened? Charlie, I have a school pharmacist, but I still want to continue my music because the talent day. Yeah, it'll be very necessary. Be very necessary. So we go do addition soon. So if we for pass through to make we hear you out, make we see how best uh, we go feel support you. Uh, All right. Pan. Like I think Pan is. Pa, pa, pan line. is on the line. So uh, call us on the numbers that we have announced for you. Zero three zero two seven nine one three two six. Call and speak to Gazi here in the studios. Uh, okay, let me come to WhatsApp and get read some few messages as we have as we have here. Uh, this one says that uh, what if someone wants to work with him as an underground artist secretly? Hey. <laughs> because I and my brother we sing, so we need to, but the secretly also. 
<laughs> okay, this one says that. Wow, I never knew Gazi, Miss Master Gazi, is this humble? Okay, we have a caller. Hello, good afternoon. <laughs> Hello, good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. Okay, uh, please turn down the volume of your TV set. Gazi is here, Pacho. What are you doing, Kasa? Um, I'm from Tamale. Right, let's hear you from Tamale. Speak to Gazi. Um. Uh, I don't know what to say, but yeah, it, it's a big opportunity to hear from me. Mm. Hey, um, hey, 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 man. I encourage our up, up, upcoming artists that, like, anyone can make it. So, I don't know, the, like, the kind of advice you can give to us for the we up, the upcoming artists. Um, like, I don't know what to say, but we just need a little advice from him. Yeah, so the because, upcoming artists... Uh, it, it's, not a, it's not an easy job. Yeah, so what you have to do is... So you just need a little advice for me. Okay, can, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Yo, so the upcoming artist, the, what you have to do is, if you not give up, if you work hard, and you okay. see at times, you, if you try to invest small things where it be over you, because at times we don't push ourselves. Push yourself. Say, ah, Charlie, may I be upcoming, but I still want to work with Master Gazi. I want to work with K. I I want to work with Qubit. I want yeah. to work with Breezy. Push yourself. Okay. Then one of the things go push you through, you understand? But every day if you say, ah, maybe I don't have, I can't go anywhere. You will be sitting okay. down and add the and add the Limit yourself. <laughs> okay, okay. Right, right. So uh, call us on right. So call us on zero three zero two seven nine one three two six zero two zero uh zero three zero two seven nine one three two six. Call us and speak to Gazi here in the studios. This one says that. Hi, I never knew you were this humble. What contribute or what contribute to your humility? Hmm. Well, some people say I'm not humble, so <laughs> that one will be an any day. Any part, any part, yeah, so I don't have the day. Me, I just you know, as I said, I try to put myself in anything I'm doing. Mm. Right now, if I stop producing and say I want to go and sell pure water, I'll make sure that I put the same energy, energy into it. it yeah. So, uh, and you know, relationship wise. Mm. When I'm working with people, I try to create that surrounding mm. or that environment for everybody to feel comfortable. Yeah. So in that case, I, get, I try to, you know, I get to get more vibes with people, like we try yeah. to become more close. Yeah. I've one of the producers that our time to have worked with a whole lot of artists, like way back, like the JQ, them and all those, but you know, JQ has produced for many yeah, exactly, artists, yeah. like, you know, yeah, I've been one of the producers that like, work with many artists, yeah. because mm. I try to mm. create vibes Very with them. Well. Yeah. Hello, good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. Oh, we lost the caller. Right. So please call. Don't call the WhatsApp number. Please call the, the telephone number that is on the screen. You lower the volume on your, of your TV set when you call. Lower the volume of your TV set when you call. 0302791326. If you are calling us outside Ghana, all you need to do is to add plus 233, then 302... Seven nine one three two six. So call us wherever you're watching us from. Call us and have that conversation with Gazi. Right? Okay. This one. The. Okay. So you you you. Before I read this one, maybe you should you should complete. Uh. Uh. You 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 were talking about how JQ have worked with so many artists, which we all know. And with okay, the, the caller. Hello. Good afternoon. <laughs> Hello. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Yes, sir. Speak to yeah. Gazi. Yeah, this is Charles calling from Ho. Okay, Ho, talk hey, to Gazi. Hey, yeah. hey, Charles. So, um, I, I am a gospel musician. I want to find out from your guest if he is interested in gospel. That's one. And then if he is, um, what are the steps, what advice will he give me? You now, I've done some recordings. Uh, I'm still in the studio doing some. Uh, but I've not come out with any track yet. But I, I've done about three tracks that are mounted already. What kind of advice would he give me? Well, um, right now the major thing you need to is how to promote the, the songs out there. Yeah. Because, you know, recording the song is one. That you have the material now. So now how to market it outside it is what you have to plan on it. Yeah. So try to get a small team around. You people should brainstorm and then know the next step that you want to mm -hmm. take. And you can start from your community and to your region, then you come to the whole, you know, Ghana. And it's, it's not late because it's most of the time right now, everything is based on uh, promotion. 
You understand? Find a strategy of how best you can promote it, and I think you'll be you'll be ready to go. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. So, so well, la, la, one last thing. It's like, uh, producers these days are not common. I wish you are right now. I think producers are common, you know. Most of the young boys, because of how the technology is growing, plenty of, but the thing is, they don't do with full time, or they don't do it professionally, or they are yeah. not... Oh, yeah, that, yeah. Their hands no strong yet. Yeah. So, when they do, then you now bring it to the, the biggest platform or the biggest studio to you know finish it up yeah yeah all right this one yeah please can i have his personal number or that of the label thank you and this is two, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one. <laughs> just just follow me on uh, my instagram at mm. master gazi everything is there then we vibe wow 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 right gazi uh you know this is a youth empowerment television show and a lot of people are inspired by it, whatever you do and all of those things even aside the music you are a leader you're a role model and all of that i want you to advise the young people of today so this is your camera so that eh, okay <laughs> if we don't hello good afternoon Afternoon. your name and where you're calling us from sir uh, okay my name is aziz Denby from ashaman okay speak to gazi from ashaman yeah speak to gazi hey yeah, ashaman okay. what's up how's it what are the few you are the few you are? Uh, which are, are the few you pass? Are like, are you music you produce? Some of some boys music you produce. Are you say yeah? Nice one, nice yeah, one. You know, Stone Boy is family, so we, we try to give them. I they like the way Yeah, I they like your connection to with Stone Boy. I they like that connection we have. Yeah man, yeah man. Thank you, man. But you be artist or what do they do? <laughs> oh, unfortunately, unfortunately, we have left him. So, uh, I want you to advise the young people watching you on this camera. Hey, shall we all be young? Yeah, so, but 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 the, but the part you choose there is the people they follow you. Hey, yeah, tell me, tell me, young. <laughs> <laughs> so, Charlie, all, all what I can tell the people are this: is Ciano, mm. you know. Everywhere hard, yeah. But if you're able to, you know, do what you know how to do best, you can still sustain yourself. Yeah. You know, you do. You wouldn't want to blame people a lot. Mm -hmm. You make sure you manage whatever you have. Mm -hmm. So we all need to be vigilant, and then also learn. Probably you might attend to, uh, or you might decide to do a course mm -hmm. in school, or whatever. But pay attention to whatever is also in you. Yeah. You might have a talent. That might become bigger. Yeah, we know people who are who were doctors, and today they are putting it aside and they are doing something else. Mm -hmm. So when they want to go back, they can still go because there are some of the things you can still go and study and know. So we should pay very, uh, we, should, we should pay attention to ourselves very well, yeah. so that anything that our mindset or it is in, in us will come out for us to do it bigger. Yeah. Because all what we need in this world is making something, you know, out getting that good money supporting the family living a good life that is all yeah you understand so we all need to stay careful and take care of ourselves Charlie let's stay away from drugs and all that yeah 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 right so that is a solid advice from the man himself and I'm sure you guys have been inspired by today's edition of youth empowerment television show we thank you so much uh, Charlie. Gazi, for, for, for coming cool. through. Charlie it's been a pleasure yeah, been a pleasure Charlie, if you want to get to him make sure you go on Instagram go on Instagram to his page and so that you can get all the information and all of those things there as well my name is Richmond I'm a this is where time will permit us on another exciting edition of youth empowerment television show if it's a prayer say something for us we always come here to do this for God and country bye bye